Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Skyrim. Alright, when we left off, we had just reached the Imperial camp to try and do a mission to help retake the Pale. I assume this is the Pale. That is what it is, right? Yeah, this is the Pale. Which is a section of Skyrim, I think, around Morthal. Anyway, we've got to talk to Leg Something Ricka to here. The General yeah, and I I'm have here. our disagreements. But he's the best hope for both the Empire and Skyrim. Fair enough. Reporting for duty. I need you to deliver some false orders to the Stormcloak commander in Dawnstar. Oh, it's Dawnstar, okay. But first, we need to get our hands on some rebel orders to make the forgeries. Ah. The Nightgate and Candlehearth Inns are frequent stops for Stormcloak runners. See if you can't convince one of the innkeepers to help you. One way or another, get me those documents. Fair enough, I but can do that. But don't do anything rash if you go to Windhelm. Uh, well, soldier, can you do this? I'm not sure. <laughs> Consider it done. Stay sharp out there. Come on, we can do this. We can do this shit. However, this overburdening will probably slow us down. However, when I was bored and looking through my stuff, turns out we had a filter of strength the entire fucking time. So, there we go. That's done. We can easily head ourselves back to... Probably our home first. Uh, yeah, and then drop off the dragon scales and dragon bones we acquired over killing the dragons, Alduin, and the dragon that attacked that camp. Yeah, we can do that. I'm going to take a drink from my Verners here. Give me a moment. Yeah, I need to do something during these long load screens. Might as well, right? Items can be stored safely in any containers in your home, but items kept in any other containers may not be there later when you go to retrieve them. In some of the Skyrim's darkest recesses, blah, 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 the dead still walk. <laughs> Where the living fear to tread. Yeah, about that. I don't fear no skeletons. It's easy. You can knock them apart with just, like, one little swipe. From a backhand, really. You can <laughs> you can just backhand those motherfuckers and down on the ground they go. Alright. Now we got a whole bunch of stuff here. Mora Tampanella. Uh there was something I needed to plant, but I Oh, it was in the other place that I was planting that. That's right, in the other house. I forgot. I forgot. I forgot that we had that, actually. We had that other house. I thought it was my other file. Whoop, no, we want those leaks. We want those leaks there, and we want them there forever. Because they help make us good food. Alright. Sure shit ton better than anything else. Let's look in the chest, see what we need to drop in here. Uh, Corundum ingots. I'm pretty sure we have a couple. Yeah, we do. We got seven. Jesus. Hubert. Horatio. Okay. Okay. <laughs> It was Jesus HH. Okay, I'm gonna stop being stupid now. And uh, I think we'll forge some jewelry because I know we have the um, needed amount. Ooh, that would be. sells really well. Let's make that. And. Let's make stuff we can actually sell later. Uh, we can make a couple of gold ruby necklaces too. Why not? Yeah, that'll work. That'll be perfect. And we can make a couple silver emerald necklaces, too. That'd be nice. And what is it? What else is there? Flawless Sapphire. I'm pretty sure we still need the Flawless Sapphires, don't we? I'm pretty sure. I don't think I've uh, ran into Modesi again yet. Which I should. I should. Or Modesi. I don't, I don't remember which way the name goes. Yeah, I think we have made everything I really need to make. I still have too much weight because of the dragon bones and scales, so heading into the house we go. Ah, this rain is nice. It's like it echoes where I'm living right now, where all the rain is happening. Kind of. It's nice. I like the rain. I mean, it can get oppressive sometimes. I mean, back when I was in Michigan, the snow was good for about two weeks, and then it was very annoying very quickly. 
There we go. Lydia, are you stupid? You know who I am. I'm the one that pays you. Oh. Hey, Lucia. Uh, not right now, hon. Sorry. Sorry. Maybe next time. Daddy's got work to do. A lot of it. Okay, let's drop some dragon bones. There we go. That's Was this a spot that I really wanted to drop them, though? Uh, yeah, that is, because there's a lot of them in there. Okay, cool. In that case, all of them go there. Um, there's something else I wanted to drop, but I don't remember what. We have a lot of soul gems that are full. A lot of them that are empty, too. Kind of should... Um, that's what I wanted to do. There was these things. Nakreen. That's... I think that's how you pronounce it. Nakreen. Uh, yeah. We'll drop that. Uh, Ragot. We're still using that until we can get a enchantment similar to it. And the rest of these we can probably enchant on our own. Yeah. Papa. Oh. Lucia, darling, you're in the way. Thank you. Did uh, you make what is it? To make what it up it? to you, I'll give you a little something something. Uh, how about a sweet roll? There you Thanks. go. There you go, darling. Have fun. Have fun eating the sweet roll. Alright. Now let's enchant some of the things we just made. Uh, in fact, I'm going to do that on my own. Be right back. Alright, I think that's enough of making the smaller things enchanted now. But I think we're going to do... A big one on our enhanced dwarven crossbow because that's going to be the ranged weapon that we use and I think what I'm going to do is throw on absorb health to it maybe maybe no no I'd rather have some sort of fire enchantment but I don't want fiery soul trap and I I can't believe I've never disenchanted a fire weapon yet so here's what we're going to do we're going to wait until we get a fire weapon to disenchant and then we're going to put that on there whoa that's a, a bit of a glitchy glitchy poo there we go yep it still glitched like that really <laughs> close up extreme close up but then again you can really see the fine detail they put into these crossbows look at all that God damn, that is gorgeous. Even for 360, that is gorgeous details. Anyway, anyway, enough of that. Enough of that for right now. Everything else was good. And we also gained a level from enchanting all of the small stuff. Pretty cool. I like it. Anyway, I like it a lot. Now, this one I know has to be at 220, which we're trying to keep it even all around at this point because I know for a fact 70 plus 220 would be 290. So there we go. Put that there. Awesome. And we got a couple perks. Uh, nothing we, we can really drop in there. And I think we were saving a perk for something special, but I don't remember what it was. Huh. Was it conjuration things? Uh, maybe? Summoner can... Necromancy would be one I kind of want. So, we can do that. Uh, yeah. We'll wait until we get to a place to put necromancy in there. And... Can't really up that one again yet. And we could do Adept Destruction, too. And how far along does chant enchanting need to go before we can do something special with that? Uh, we got that there. So we need to get to 100 for enchanting to have any need for a perk. And we need to go to 90 before we can get Daedric Smithing. Okay, okay, we can do that. We can do that. I'm pretty sure we can. Anyway, was there anything else I needed to drop? I do not think so. I do not think there was a single other thing I needed to drop. Yeah. Oh, there was some books. There were some books. What do you need, my thing? Uh, you to get out of my way, please. Not really. You're kind of not in the way anyway. But, declaration of war. Okay. 
Uh, yeah, Mysterious Akaviri. That's not what I meant to do. Press the wrong button. Drop that there. There we go. Okay. Now we get the fuck out and we start to help the war effort. Uh, let me look at how much weight I have real quick. Uh, we could also do a couple things, but I'll do that on my own time. Right now, we're going to help the war effort and dealing with that. I think I'm going to use the crossbow when I take out the, uh, the courier for the storm cloaks. I think that's what I'm going to do. Because I haven't really used that that much. And, uh, kind of want to do it again. <laughs> Revered and Legendary Dragons. We haven't really fought a lot of those. We will later, though. That's for sure. We will probably, in the upcoming run through the DLC of uh, Dawn Guard. There we go. Because that was where they came in from, wasn't it? Or was it uh, Dragonborn? I don't remember. I don't remember. It's been a long time, and my brain is off of work and thinking about other things. Nightgate Inn. Oh, did I not get the quest marker? No, I didn't engage it yet. So, head up here. And yeah, he's at the Nightgate Inn. So, maybe we could cut him off at the Great Lift? Cut him off at the Pass, maybe? Mm -hmm. We'll find out. All right. In the days of old, when dragons ruled the earth, there lived mortal men who worshipped the beast as gods. These dragon priests are long since dead, but something has awoken them from their ancient slumber. I wonder if it wasn't Alduin. You know, they used to worship more than anything. I don't know if my mic is screwing up or not. It might have screwed up in the middle of that. I've dropped it a couple times, and I hope it's not too broken. Oh, that was a little too fast. There we go. That's the one I wanted. There we go. Perfect. Now, first, I need to figure out where he is. He's still at the inn. Good. He's over there. That's where it is. So, we gotta head down and find a spot where we would easily cut him off. Hmm. That is the question now, isn't it? Things are loading in, so <laughs> it looks a little weird. That is a bear. I'd rather avoid the bear. I try not to kill animals if I can avoid it. Yeah, everything's loading in, so the frame rate's a little jittery. Sorry for those that bothers. Okay. Maybe try two hours. Maybe he'll be on the road by then. And no, he is not. The bear's agitated at something. I'm kind of curious what it's agitated at. It's Jason. Oh, it's Jason. I want to see where it's going. <laughs> We're getting distracted. Oh, it was getting, it was chasing a deer. Okay. Well, in that case, I'm just gonna get the uh, bear then because I can get both their hides then in that case uh, let's do firebolts okay, look, it's starting to hit for a lot I was holding on to that button before I even realized <laughs> that it was gonna go all right cool beans and that's still the direction he's in right yeah he's still over there why is he not moving yet? That is really weird. Oh, nope. Frame break. God damn it. Just calm the fuck down. Jesus. Okay. Stop it. Frame rate. Behave. Don't make me turn this let's play around. What am I talking about? Okay. Anyway. Whoa. Alright, that's starting to get a little agitating. Alright, cool. Now to calm down, let's go on a little further. I guess the uh, snowy areas are a little bit too much for the 360 now. 
but what the? Oh, really? Is there another bear? Where is it? Oh, trying to figure out where the bear is. It's hard to do when you only have one headphone in. Oh! Ice wraiths and ice wolves. That's something else. Can I hit this with the spell? Yes, I can. Not pinpoint all the time, but hey, that worked. Teeth. There was a quest giver, I think, in Riften that needed that, wasn't there? Uh, no, but I do still need to see Madesi anyway. Uh, and that's basically in the same place, so we could do that. We could easily do that. And he's still in the goddamn place. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna head to the inn anyway, because at this rate, we'll just be waiting forever just to ambush him. And then he'll end up running past us if I keep waiting the way I was. Alright, there we go. Put these away. It looks a little suspicious to have fire in the hands. Well, it would be normal, because if anyone would want fire in their hands, it would probably be in this particular area. Alright. Now let's check on the uh, courier, then. Where are they at? Work. Neither. Ah, hello there. Seen traveler. any couriers lately? I tend to keep my patrons privacy. Do you now? I don't have time for this. I can get rough with you if I have to. That's a little extreme. That's more stray cat. Uh, his life is in danger. It is? Well, that's different. Yeah, that's more persuasion. Well, are you going to say it? It is. He was here. Okay, there we but go. But he left. If you leave now, you can probably catch him. Or you can just wait here. He'll be back soon enough. Fair enough, but I will go get him instead. Fair enough. I will go and talk to him. Where is he at, then? There he is. He's right over there. He did not get far. Apparently. So, we could probably just run and catch up with him now. So, I'm gonna do just that. Wait, how far is he? I can't really tell him. Yeah, he's actually pretty far. So, uh... <laughs> actually, I'll probably... No, no, I won't. I won't cut this. Why would I cut this? Alright, there we go. Let's start going as fast as possible. Taking all the shortcuts we can. Up first, we're going to be doing that swap, because that's what we're going to do. Alright, here we go. And he is quite a ways away. I figured he'd be not running like that by now. And I am out of sprint, and I am out of patience. Very, very easily. You know what? You know what? Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. I'm gonna fast travel to the Windhelm stables. <sighs> okay. How did he get that far? How did he get past me? Is what I'm asking. Huh. <sighs> I must have had to talk with one of them first, and then he would have... Oy vey. Yes, I know the Khajiit are a feline race. That's why we picked them. That's why we are them. Huh. Horsey! Okay. Where is he at? He's still out there? Really? Oh, he's on his way back. Okay. That's annoying. I know, this is a weird, wild-ass goose chase. That's what this quest basically is, though, so... 
it's <laughs> it's kind of how it's gonna go. Sorry if it bugs some of you. There's really nothing I can do about it. All right. That is one weird looking little pillar there. Is he in the Night Gate Inn this time? I'm hoping he is. Oh boy. Alright. Where's he at? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now? Where'd he go? Okay, let's do world map. Uh, fuck it. Fuck it. We're waiting here. 12 hours. That's what we're doing. We're going to wait 12 hours. Because at this point, we're going back and forth, back and forth, and we're going nowhere. Okay. I'll just do it here for right now. Oh! Here she is. Oh, okay. No time to talk. Out of my way. Really? Okay, I'll get out of your way then. I guess she just gotten out of bed and now she's raring to go. Uh, he said it was a he. He said that the courier was a he. I'm confused. No time to talk. Out of my way. Never mind. Huh. <laughs> Doing it here would be uh, kind of stupid because we have like three different witnesses. Uh, so we'll wait a bit. We'll wait until she's out of range. I'll take the crossbow out, because that's not suspicious at all. Okay. How far along should we wait? Uh, just down this way, maybe? Because that's where she's going to be, isn't she? Yeah, there she is. And try and lead the shot. Nope, that did not work. Damn, I keep missing. That, I'm not even doing that. Okay. Oh, let's just run. Just run it. Leg it! Until we get a good angle on the shot. There we go. Alright, and we're getting good, and down she goes. <laughs> Got one in the arm, one in the back, and one in the chest, it looks like. Trying to figure out that grouping. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Stormcloak documents. They'll take all of those, there we go. Yeah, it was one in the chest, one in the back, and one in the arm. Alright, cool. We're all good. We are good on that. It took a little bit longer than I wanted it to, but we're all good on that. <laughs> that went everywhere. Anyway, I think we're going to end the episode here for right now. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. Share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat playing games for you.